Welcome back to our channel. Today we are doing a um, recipe video for you guys. So this is going to be pesto pasta. And these are the ingredients we are using. So we are using a cup of garlic and um, a cup of pine nuts. Grated parmesan cheese, freshly, uh, fresh. Okay. And we've got some oil, a cup of oil here. So is this just what oil is it? Canola you, oil? You or? can use, uh, I've got half extra virgin and half vegetable. Okay, there you go guys. So we've got some basil in the um, oh, it blender. Yeah, yeah. Half a bunch, uh, I mean one bunch. What's happening with us today? We can't even talk. One bunch of basil, but I'm using two. Because okay. I freeze uh, half of it. And I like to add just a little bit of water. Before I blend it, just a little bit. Cold water. There you go, guys. And if I need some more, I'll add some more. And we're gonna blend it all together now. This is noisy. <laughs> I'll just add some oil. Oil. I put some garlic. Did they say me put the garlic? Yeah, yeah. They saw you put the garlic. So you only add the oil a little bit of, at a time. A little bit at a time. Yeah. Everything is a little bit at a time, but I'm just I just put the garlic in all together because it crushes anyway. More basil? Yeah, the basil, yeah. So we got more basil here. Because we're we're Lebanese family and um, we love our garlic and we love our garlic and I want to freeze some so I don't have to keep making it all the time. The bench has already been wiped down. hard to open that's why I make I like to make a lot at a time see it's still got to add the pine nuts and that'll thicken it because I need it like a toothpaste So that's too yeah, that's too thin. Can't believe it. The, um I wash each one by one the uh, leaves. The leaves, yeah. So let's see the consistency of it now. How's the consistency? Even if it's too thin, it doesn't really matter. Yeah. Because you boil the you boil the pasta. pasta and then you drain it really well, and then you put it back on the stove on low heat, and then you put it you put your pesto on top and mix it really well. I didn't have to even use that much oil. Mmm. I still have some salt and pepper. That smells and tastes really good. Do you get a plate? Not a plate. 
I think, uh, don't you want to take some? Here, here, I can take them. Is that enough or no? I think that's a bit small. Let me just wipe it down. Oh, uh, this smells really good. No joke. I'm going to add some more cheese because I like my cheese. Oh, yeah, this is, um, this is fresh. I just got it from the deli. Let's take my cheese off. That's how much I love my cheese. See, everyone look. And more. And I'm really happy because I didn't have to look. I didn't even have to use much oil. Usually don't measure, but because my hands are wet, I just put half a tablespoon. That cheese, if I'm not going to put much because you're dead. He says, um, I always um, make him cry when I use that. Pepper. Because it's, yeah, it's a bit. Got me to taste a bit of taste the salt. Ah yes, please. I like because if you don't put that little bit of water when you first start, it it's really hard the blender to do it. Mmm. What? No, nah, it's perfect. Really? How okay. good does it taste? It's done, so I need to wash my hands. Try not to use the the jar one because there's too much stuff no, in there. It's Amazing. This is my second plate. Mm. Oh my god. Let me know if you try it in the comments below. And I'll be back with another video soon. Thank you for watching. Stay safe and goodbye.